I don't want a word of negativity about the, the, if I can call it a mustache. It's a beta test, man. Just let me try. But ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Buster, I Shinobi. We have episodes 401 and 402 of our One Piece watch today. And last episode was explosive to say the least. Learned a ton about Roger and what actually happened with his execution where he turned himself in. And a Navy Admiral making it to the archipelago, riding in on a cannonball. I'm very excited to see what Kizaru is all about. If you're new to the channel, drop us up and hit that big boy bell and let's hop into it. God dang it, Sanji. They always have these dramatic goodbyes. I know Rayleigh just stares at, at Luffy and just sees Roger. I know it. And it's a good feeling. Look at our crew. Chopper moving his little arms like that. <laughs> to say the least. I wish he had explained more about like the hockey energy and stuff. Oro Jackson. The ship that Tom built. I want to see what... Well, I guess we got like a really short glimpse of what it looked like in... uh, Was it Shanks' story? But not really a look. Yeah, it was about to get... I mean, they understand an admiral is coming, but like, it's bad. I'm scared. He rode in on a cannonball, bro. Oh. Oh, was? It's a straight up raid of the archipelago. Who's he trying to call? His voice is slick. Real name Borsalino? Kizaru. His suit is so cool. No! Shot, Marco! You cannot be serious! Ain't hey, no way. This is an opportunity for him to flex. That's why they're doing this. What? Wait, so that means he had definitely is a devil fruit. It passed right through him. It's going through him. Yeah, it has to be Logia because that's usually like, what, like elements and stuff. Like it goes through them. Definitely Logia. Like he's made of something else. It's always physical attacks. Probably who he's looking for. Sentomaru? Who is Sentomaru? Oh, a subordinate. <laughs> run away uh. is that his leg oh my god Dog. I figured he'd be OP. We've seen how Kiji. He just shot a nuke out of his leg and it's just like chilling. It didn't even like he's not even dropped off sweat. Oh my gosh. What are you gonna do, Apu? What are you gonna do? No shot. Oh no. Apu is literally going to perish. There's no way. So I wonder what Al Kiji thinks of Kizaru, like if they get along. What's the third's name? Akainu is the third one. What? All the soldiers turn to kids or old people? Whose power is this? Is it Jewelry Bonnie's power? Oh. She ages you? She just never stops eating. Young or old? Damn, that's bold of her to like be attacking Marines even when there's an admiral here. They stay like that permanently? Watch out for the rookies. Oh, shoot, Capone. He's trying to leave. Oh, yeah, we never really did see what Capone did. Beige, beige. I like this. We're getting to see like all the rookies take part in, in battles and stuff. It's sick. Oh, there's a terror card guy. What was his name? Hawkins. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I love his fit, dude. The glasses and everything work so well. He's so tall. Are, are all three admirals that tall? Aokiji's about that tall, too. He pulled the right card. Now, Hawkins has like a cult. Oh my gosh. Killer is just attacking Kuma. Oh goodness. No, but he's he's like sort of like a robot type. It won't burn him. Let's go. He's getting in there, baby. Yes, sir. Oh, dude. But it like it flexed Kuma at the end of Thrower Bark just to like put this into perspective. Oh, no. Oh, you roomed. Room. Shambles. 
Oh, shoot. Okay, so yeah, that, so that just switches switches two people or two things. Shambles. Get in there, kid. Yes, sir. Straight up crush him. I want to know the full extent of kid's power. Because, like, we've seen how he, like, forms... Oh, we actually, like, flatten him, kind of. He always says, yeah, at the end. And he's right back up. Darkuma is so cool. Oh, no, the gloves are off. Wait, this hand looks different. They changed it. No, it's just a bomb shooter. It used to be, like, the pad. Like, the, the panda paw pad. I wonder if he just has, like, different attachments. Did he already take care of them, bro? Oh, my gosh. Brother. That lasted, like, five seconds. I guess he shot a bomb. Are they firing at Archipelago? Wait, where is this? What? He has a, 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 a fleet in his body? Dog Capone is sick! Oh my gosh! There's a cavalry! And once they get to a certain range, they turn normal size. That is so cool. Wait, that's actually dope. He has like an army inside of him. That is so absurd. Father. They call him father. All right, that's actually sick, man. Oh my gosh. So now we've seen his power. We got to see what Jewelry Bonnie did. I'm very curious about Hawkins and his tarot cards. I mean, he's all about fate and whatnot. I don't know. I like the rookies showing off, though. Showing why they got the bounties that they have. Yep, Kuma's here, baby. Oh, shoot, the monk. Dog, he's taking everybody on? Wait, what timeline is this? I'm so confused. Like, at what point did the Straw Hats find them? Oh, here come the cards. What? Chance of defeat, 100%. Bro's playing a TCG right now. Who is Sento Marv? I feel like that sounds kind of familiar, but I don't know. Maybe not. It's just one of those things in my head. Oi. To fight him, to take him down. Dog, I feel like he just obliterates Hawkins. And 249 is high. Speed is weight. Kicked at the speed of light. Dude, imagine a fight with him and Sanji. I feel like him and Sanji is the equivalent of like Mihawk and Zoro. Oh. Was that the kick that he kicked Hawkins with? Where did it even come from? But they can't see it because of the speed of light. That guy's dead. Yeah, it just flew across the island. Wait, now he's just shooting it out of his finger. Dog, he seems way more powerful than Aokiji. Aokiji is powerful, don't get me wrong. He's burning like straw things, but it's, it's correlated to people. Like Aokiji, the scale is crazy with his ice. Maybe we just haven't seen him flex enough. He's straight up just like a, a god. Oh, Hawkins, he withstood it. Me too! <laughs> 10 isn't... Oh, it's his that he's... He's like having other people take the hits for him? Oh. Oh, oh shoot. Kuma took him down. Oh, man. An even stronger foe. Oh, yeah. He's, yeah. Mm -hmm. God, his eyes! I love his design so much. Dude's just chill about it. Oh. Well, that's like Oda to every character. <laughs> I just love that he's from Skypea. Oh! Oh, shoot! What's his name? X Hawk? X Hawk? Is that right? X Drake. No, Hawkins. X Drake. Dang. He said, you better do more. Yeah, he used to be a, he used to be part of the Navy, right? Drake? Oh, Euros is up. Euros is juicing. Oh, damn. Is he the size of Kuma now? Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. Why did he not do this sooner? Great stuff. He really wants to leave. But like these crazy rookies, that's not what they're about. Like, yeah, this is what they live for. God. There's no way this is at the same time, right? There's no way there's like multiple Kumas. I mean, it's possible because they're robots, but are there multiple Kumas? Oh my God, that is just disastrous. 
Yeah, because there's no way this is a separate timeline. This is all happening at the same time. Why are they so hype about it being a beam? Oh, dude, L Luffy never saw the full extent of Kuma. Zoro did. Yeah, Luffy never even saw him. Oh my gosh. Yeah, but maybe it's a different one because he doesn't have the pause. Maybe there's just different ones for different things. I mean, if he has a machine, they could make multiple. Let's go, Frankie. Atta boy, get in there. Will it do much? I don't know. Oh. Oh, shoot! Let's go, Frankie! Yeah, but still. Luffy's jumping in. Oh, shoot. The veins on him. Thank you. Thank you. It's a warlord, bro. Impossible multiple. He seems different. Dude, there's multiple Gomas! Oh, my gosh. The question now is how many? When we know if this is the same timeline, it's all happening at the same time, there's three, right? This, yeah, three. Because also with, with Law and all of them, they're fighting one. That is absolutely absurd. Oh, is that who he's looking for? That is a giant axe. Uncle Kizaru. Oh, it's his nephew? What did they say their name was? I, I totally forgot already. These are some insane fights, man. How well will Luffy do against it? Should I know who this is? It, it kind of did a shot like it was like revealing and I was like, oh, have I seen them before? Should I have? This is so insane, man. It like, slowly, I, I think maybe it is just the same Kuma and I'm just confused right now. I, maybe it's trying to lead me to believe that. But at this point, if there are multiple Kumas, that is actually terrifying because we've seen how powerful one is and how hard it is to take down one. Thinking about multiple is just horrifying. But dude, Kizaru's power! Episode 402. Let's let's, let's keep on trucking. The sound effects for it are just sick, man. Come on, Luffy. Let's get it hit him, baby. You gotta be fast. You are fast. I've seen Gear 2. I feel like Gear 3 would be even necessary for him because he's such a unit. It's crazy when Frankie now looks small to me, considering how enormous Kuma is. It just like puts it into perspective. They're just straight up running. I don't blame them. What about Nami and all of them? The rest of the crew. Machines! Surely it's just fantasy. You're calling something fantasy in a world of devil fruits. <laughs> oh, Brooke. Look, you basically are dead. Oh, Zoro and Sanji go. Sanji's got Diablo Jambe ready, baby. Diablo? Diablo. They're teaming up, baby. No, I was right. They got a trouble team up if they want to do any kind of damage. Surely it does something. It has to, dude. There's no way it doesn't. If it doesn't, then there's no hope. Okay, it blew him back, but so did Frankie's coup event. Now we wait and we see. Dude, all three of those moves together have to do so much damage. He's going to get right back up. Mm -hmm. It's not going to be like that. Yeah. Dude, the fact that that's not enough too is insane. I think there's triplets, guys. Oh, true. Well, they have different moves. Yeah, because the one in Thor Park was insanely fast. He's still going to get up. Yep. So they are. They're like specialized for things. Oh, my gosh. Whoo. So which one is the... That one took his gloves off. I don't see the pause. Which one's the one they found on Thriller Bark? I wonder if there's like a main one. Oh! Okay, baby! Give it to him! This can't be that one from Thriller Bark. Yeah, he would have evaded that too. These seem like a tier down from the Thriller Bark one, but maybe that was just because like we were on the end of our rope. Oh, he's down, down. Yeah, there's no way. I mean, Kuma's an, a robot, basically. Doesn't, I'm guessing he doesn't, like, feel pain or anything. I mean, maybe, because, like, blood kind of came off of him when they hit him. And he looked, like, surprised. Kizaru's laser. Recreate Kizaru's offensive. Oh, and Vegapunk was the one that made Kuma. The pacifistas. They're a collective, like, known as a collective? And Vegapunk took his power and put it into Kuma. Huh. How 
How do you do that? But I feel like the possibilities are endless if you're able to do that. Former Rear Admiral. I think Drake knows he doesn't stand a chance. Yeah. Oh, because he was, he was part of the higher-ups at one point. But the fact that he was part of the higher-ups and he switched sides says a lot. And Kizaru is so, so chill because, yeah, he knows that they have the upper hand in terms of, like, strength and everything. No way is he taking him on. Oh, wait, what? He's a Zoan! How big? Is he a T-Rex? He is a dinosaur, bro! A rare ancient. Oh, I see. It's not like a modern animal you can find. Oh, no. God, they don't stand a chance. His design is really cool. His fit and everything. That's what I was saying. Blood flows, yeah. Even though he's like a machine. <laughs> Guys, don't forget about me. Oh no. He's so effortless. Bro, what are you thinking, Hawkins? How do you still not think you're in the shadow? Oh. Uh, uh, um, uh, is he spaghetti? Oh, he's a straw doll himself. God, he is frightening looking. God damn. Demon con conquering form? He's trying to nail him down? <gasps> Kizaru is so broken. It introduced all these insane looking rookies and how... Uh, how do you guess how powerful they are? Just to have them to get rolled to reinforce the strength of the Navy. Oh my God. Oh. No one else is going to step in. Who would step in right now? <gasps> oh, shoot. It is music theme. He's like curious. All his body parts are instruments. Oh, okay. Uh-huh. Was it simply to distract? Papu's kind of got them no. tunes. Dude, Kizaru's voice actor actually nailed it. Like, sounding very menacing, but, like, really, like, lax at the same time. It does remind me a lot of Aokiji's. Like, Aokiji's, like, some, like, chill dude were at the same time very intimidating. Guys, funky, too. You shouldn't meet Brooke. Actually, Brooke's kind of, like, kind of a different style. If you can hear it, stay tuned! That's you! That's you! Kizaru! Even Kuma's uh, enthralled by it. Or just in. in, in <laughs> they're all just staring. Is it like nullifying? Oh! Oh! What? Just detach the body part? Wait, he's actually getting hits in! Oh, shoot! Let's go! That's my scratch man, baby! He's just made of light? That's what it looks like. His whole insides are just light. I feel like that's not enough. I, uh, um, it depends on how his power works. <laughs> oh, he's up. Well, kind of. Can he just reattach himself? Oh. Would that even be Logia if you're light incarnate? Yeah, it would be. Yeah. He's the embodiment of light. Oh my gosh. Dude, he's like the exact opposite of Blackbeard then. Because Blackbeard's in, in, inherently just like darkness incarnate. Oh no, he's gonna he's gonna pay for that. Yata mirror? Like a mirror of light? Oh, what reflects? <gasps> Dog, Kizaru is so cool. He is straight clowning them. I'm gonna be honest, he might be cooler than Aokiji. This is nuts. His moveset is something else. Holy. God damn. God, he's so creepy. There's no way he finishes Hawkins off. Hawkins isn't in the shadow of death. He said himself. Oh, saved by the bell! It's probably his nephew. Does he have a different phone? <laughs> I got two phones. You do have a baby transponder snail. Sentamaru. That was his name. He's got a giant axe. What is the black transponder snail? For eavesdropping? Huh? Oh, he took all of them down. They were all just made examples of. Oh no, now he's gonna go after them. Ay, ay, ay. 
dude. I mean, they've cut him up a little bit. God damn. It's so cool seeing them all work together, though, at such a like, high pace against someone that seems unbeatable. God. He just never stops. Dodge! Oh, he's getting like flashbacks. <gasps> oh, man. It's like a deer in headlights. Somebody has to move him. <gasps> oh, my God. I feel like that'll only get worse, too. He still feels the pain from it. You don't understand, Luffy. Sanji knows. I mean, it hasn't been that long. It's like a copy. So maybe like one is real and then the others are cop. No, because the, the one that they fought was a robot, too. Or maybe like, like I said, like one's the main one and the others are like, I don't know, branches. Either way, this is just absolute madness. I knew Kizaru was here like two episodes ago. He, he came in on the cannonball and I maybe I just underestimated him. He is so overpowered and not like a bad way. It's it's in a very intimidating way. And I love that. I love how I said, like I said, how they brought in these rookies made you be like, oh, dang, like they're all very powerful. They have these crazy bounties. And then he just makes an example out of all of them. Aside from, of course, like Kid and Law and a few others, they're putting their place very quickly and again i think that's to kind of reinforce like hey the navy is no joke yeah they've been beaten a few times and luffy and his crew have succeeded in a lot of their ventures but the navy's i guess sort of like fist of power in terms of especially their admirals is still very well alive i just don't i, I I'm, I'm gonna be shocked to see what the third one does because aokiji and kizaru have really set the bar high but guys that's been it for episodes 401 and 402 over one piece watcher do drop us some on the channel if you are new and i'll catch you in the next one this space.